Hey everybody, it's Lori and I'm coming to you from my kitchen, which is also known as my uh, craft station. This is where I do my painting, this is where I do my mixing, my baking, and I've had a lot of people ask me for a tutorial on how I make my glasses. Glasses like this. And also glasses like this with full paint. Now these are stemless 20.5 ounce wine glasses that I get at the dollar store. And believe it or not, they're very solid. They um, are pretty thick thick enough that when I bake them, they do great. So anyway, I thought I would start at the beginning. Uh, people wanting to know how to paint these glasses and they want to know details starting at the very beginning. And it's kind of ironic because I learned how to do this by watching videos on YouTube. I had seen these glasses and I thought, well, there's gotta be a tutorial out there somewhere. And there were a couple but I thought I'd make my own. So I figured the first place we'd start is with paint. Now, I get my paint at the craft stores. Uh, you can get your paint really anywhere as long as it's a good quality craft paint. I have several different brands here. Um, I'll tell you another secret. Buy your paint when it's on sale wait for a coupon. Wait until one of your local arts and crafts stores has a sale, 40% uh, off, 50% off. I don't have to tell you guys, you know when those things happen. I always check the sales to make sure and then I go in and stock up on paint. The other thing I have sitting here, this brand is actually Liquitex. Um, this is an acrylic medium which let me just tell you, I had no idea what that was when I started doing this. And um, it took a lot of research. This is an acrylic medium and it's for glass. So I add this to my paint, helps it flow better, gives it a little bit of a sheen, um, helps with the consistency. And I'll go through that a little bit more when we start mixing paint. So that's where we start finding the paint you want, finding the colors you want. Not every color goes together, folks. Let me just tell you, I have ended up with some glasses that look like mud. So sometimes I cheat and I actually will look for color palettes, pa uh, colors that go well together. Uh, right now, I don't have any right here next to me, but right now I'm working on pinks and uh, fuchsia, purples, colors like that, because it's almost Valentine's Day. So those are the colors that I'll be working with. Um, so anyway, that's it. This is uh, the paint segment of this video, and now we can move on to mixing.